Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today's video is going to be a shop with me at Target and Hobby Lobby for fall 2020. I can't wait to see what we find here. Most of my decorations are ready from Target and Hobby Lobby. So I already know that they have some awesome things every year. So I can't wait to see what we can find now. If you like these kind of shop with me videos, make sure you leave a like and leave a comment and tell me, have you already decorated for fall or are you planning on decorating for fall and Halloween? I can't wait to see what you guys do. Head over to Instagram. Make sure that you tag me in any of your decorations if any of this inspires you. And make sure that you subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss out on my next video, which will be Decorate With Me. It's coming out in just a couple of days. So let's go ahead and get inside and get shopping. So I started out in the Target dollar spot. I don't know if you're a sucker like me, but I literally can't walk past this area and not at least look and pick up one or two things. I know not everything's a dollar anymore like it used to be, but they're still pretty great deals. Like these little floral arrangements were only $3 each. They had some cute Thanksgiving items, candles, and even these Tabasco baskets, which are usually pretty pricey at other stores, but they were about $5, so that's pretty great. And of course, some really cute little fall wreaths. I might pick one of those up as well. My Target didn't have as many Halloween items as they have in years past, but they did have some cute little ones that I would pick up if I had kids and some crafts. So all you mamas out there, there was definitely a lot of good deals to pick up there. Next, I headed it to the back of my store where all of the rest of the fall and Halloween decor was and it went straight to the neutral pumpkins. Target has the best assortment for little fall goodies. I did pick up one that you'll see in my haul and I cannot wait to try it. I love this area of Target because it's always so neutral and even if you're not a farmhouse lover like I am, there's something here for everyone. Whether you like to go all out for fall or just want a fall vibe with colors, there's something for you. Target has really stepped up their front door wreath game. My store had so many options as you can see here. I love that they still had some greenery because you could easily add a seasonal bow and make it work all year round, which would be perfect for these wreaths right here. There were so many new options for pumpkin colors this year, like this neutral pink and wicker. I'm really loving that combo and would love to see them styled in someone's house. It had some cute Thanksgiving specific themed fall decor as well, which would be awesome if you're hosting Thanksgiving at your house this year. As you can see, they had some cute activities and decor for kids and of course, adorable little plates and napkins. So one thing I might have to go back for is these little pumpkins, you guys. They light up and they're so adorable. And now my favorite part of Target, the Magnolia Homes collection. I will say going to Waco and going to the plantation is on my bucket list. I really hope to make it there one day, but for now my little section of Target will have to do.
Target had some really cute little Halloween outfits as well. I don't know if you already know this, but I am a teacher and I try to wear a cute themed shirt for holidays, so I'm definitely picking one of these up. And now we're at Hobby Lobby. I love going to Hobby Lobby. It is a guilty pleasure of mine, even if I don't need anything. It's so relaxing walking around the store. I feel like it's just so peaceful and they have so many things to look at. Hobby Lobby is definitely the place to go if you need any greenery, vase fillers, or garland. They have every color scheme, as you can see here, that you would ever need. So many pumpkins. I was so impressed at how many different pumpkins Hobby Lobby had this year, all different sizes. As you can see here, my Hobby Lobby pretty much only had small ones left except for these big white ones, which I loved. It would be really fun to decorate with your kids and you could use them year after year. These dish towels that Hobby Lobby had and little table runners were so cute. I love the Let's Talk Turkey. So adorable if you're hosting Thanksgiving. I've been really loving decor lately that's royal blue and gold, so this area was just so appealing to the eye. If you love buffalo plaid, I will say that Hobby Lobby is the place to go. They had so many options for buffalo plaid fall decor, as you can see here. Look at those little pumpkins, they are adorable, and same with these little signs. So many options. Alright guys, we're back home and I wanted to show you one of the first things that I got from Hobby Lobby. I got the welcome sign that I showed you that says welcome on the front. And when you turn it over, it says harvest. So I'm going to go ahead and turn that. And this is something that Hobby Lobby has almost year after year. So it's a great investment because you can use it all year round. So here are a few other things that I picked up from Target. One of them was this Magnolia Homes wreath. It was only $34.99. So beautiful. And it's like a copper rust red kind of shade of leaves. And I thought it would look really beautiful on our red front door. So I picked that up. Then I went to the dollar spot and I got these little guys. They were only $3 each. They're the perfect tones for my neutral farmhouse decor. And I got the Scarecrow Crunch. If you haven't heard or seen this going around Instagram, everyone has made me crave it and I haven't even tried it yet, but I felt like it would be a nice little snack to munch on while I'm decorating for fall. And last but not least, I got these little hay barrels from Walmart. I actually had a Walmart grocery pickup order to pick up when I was out shopping. If you've never done Walmart grocery pickup, it's awesome. 
it's free and they just bring all your groceries or whatever you need out to your car and these were on there so for four dollars i felt like i couldn't beat it and it would look really cute with the harvest sign that i picked up at hobby lobby to put out front by the door guys that's all for today's video i hope that you enjoyed it if you did make sure you leave a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the bell if you haven't already and i'll see you in the next one bye